Chafin's in the game to protect the lead. One run lead for the Tigers. David Fry at the plate. This breakdown is brought to you by DraftKings. The 0-1 pitch, fastball on the outside, thrown up into the breeze, and it's going to carry all the way for a game-tying home run, and Chafin cannot believe it. Just, whoa. Uh, how the fuck? <laughs> how the fuck? <laughs> How the fuck did that get out? What the hell's going on? Solid high five there. There we go. Tie game. Still can't believe it. What was that? Fucking kidding me? Goes into the dugout. He's going to chuck his glove. Bounces back to him. He kicks it. And then all of a sudden, oh, sorry, Jesus. I didn't see you there. Uh, All good, you know? Protection. And then the hair. The hair. The hair. The hair. The hair. Looks like the wigs the Detroit Tigers fans wear those super fans who dress up like the cowardly lion looks like the wigs they wear is on his head. And here we have every other ball hit this season at a 40 degree launch angle and 96 mile per hour exit velocity. And this will let you know why he was so confused in the middle is the, the pitch he threw and all the other sides, they land not even on the warning track. Uh, Look at everywhere else where it's landed top left way on the grass and then down the left side. They're all not even on the track. I mean, okay. Middle top rights on the track, but every other ball hit with these numbers is not a home run. It's not even like warning track power. Basically at that angle and that speed, you're at the mercy of the breeze, which is how a lot of people like to relax, but it wasn't relaxing for Chafin. He threw that ball into the wind. It went out. Hilarious reaction. How the fuck? Thanks, DraftKings, for sponsoring this breakdown, and thank you to you guys for watching the breakdown. I enjoy making them. I'm glad you enjoy watching them, and I'm glad DraftKings enjoys sponsoring them. The threefer.